Don't miss a second. Today we have Patience Valier. She's Miss Wisconsin Teen USA 2014 on the pageant cast. Welcome to the Pageant Cast, your home for beauty pageant news and interviews on the internet. I'm Corey Ann Strupp, Miss Wisconsin Collegiate America 2013. You're watching the Pageant Cast, the internet's first podcast about beauty pageants. And here's your host. Tim Kretschmann. You're watching the pageant cast and I'm so glad you joined us today because we have a fantastic guest joining us via Skype. We have Patience Valier. She's Miss Wisconsin Teen USA 2014. <laughs> Hello Patience. Hello, how are you? Where are we calling you today? Um, I am at home. I am in Lake Mills, Wisconsin. Ah, not that far. I'm in Milwaukee. So. Okay. Well, Patience, I hear that you're going to a really cool school. That You have some pretty exciting things in the future yes. for you here. Can you tell us about yes. this? I plan on attending the New York Film Academy. I am attending the one-year conservatory for film production. Um, so I get to be like on the business end and behind the cameras. I am not too hot about being on screen. So... I'll be studying production, um, and I actually have a 20% tuition discount scholarship that I won um, as the state title holder. So for incoming competitors, that's a big plus. Scholarships are awesome. <laughs> You're a beautiful young lady, and you want to be on the other side of the camera? Mm -hmm. I do. I do. I feel like um, as much as it helps to be attractive in acting, um, you, you also have to be very good at it. <laughs> and um, I'm a lot more competitive when it comes to a business and um, the intellectual side of things rather than delivering a performance. I just feel like it's my niche. Tell me how you got started in pageants. Tell me about your pageant seasons, past pageants that you've been involved in. Um, Miss Wisconsin Teen USA was the only title that I ever actually competed for, but I competed for it four times. Um, I started when I was 14, and I came back every year. My freshman and sophomore year of high school, I was in the top 15 as a semifinalist. And then my junior year of high school, I was third runner-up to um, Kate Redeker. I don't know if she'll be watching, but um, I, I really admire her a lot. And um, I was her, um, I took her place <laughs> as the title holder the next year. So, Patience, you, you got started in pageants when you were 14 year old. Now you've uh, won a state title. What would the 14 year old version of yourself feel about the woman you've become uh, today? Well, I feel like as a first year competitor, as a freshman in high school, as a 14 year old girl, I was very introverted and very shy and um, I did it just for fun. I was like, I'm going to try something new. I have no clue what I'm doing. And um, now I, I went into it with a different attitude. I went to make friends. I went to you know, um, just to with a purpose. I had a purpose. I had a mission, and I wanted to get it out there. And um, yeah, I guess that, those are the big differences. Well, thanks so much, okay. Patience. We're going to be right back with more with you here <laughs> on the Pageant Cast. Don't nobody go nowhere. Join the Facebook group that's taking Facebook by storm, the Great Lakes Pageant Scene. It's a forum for pageants held in states bordering the Great Lakes, Minnesota, Wisconsin, Illinois, Indiana, Michigan, Ohio, Pennsylvania, New York, and even into the province of Ontario. This is no void forum. We don't allow bashing, but we do allow great pageant results, pageant contestant and title holder appearance announcements, photos, videos, podcasts, 
and article. That's the Great Lakes Pageant Scene on Facebook. Hi, I'm Grayson Hodgkiss, your Miss Illinois Teen USA 2013, and you're watching Pageant Cast, home of the most beautiful audience in podcasting. The Pageant Cast Crowning Chamber. On August 4th, Miss Teen USA 2014 was announced. Uh, the first runner up was Veda Man, Miss Mississippi Teen USA, leaving Kaylee Graham of South Carolina, she's from the city of Champlin, as the new and reigning Miss Teen USA. If for any reason the new Miss Teen USA cannot fulfill her duties, I will be there ready to take over. And if they, if they can't get me the first runner-up, we'll do it. So, congratulations to both of you. We're about to announce this year's winner. Erin, are you ready? I'm really nervous. Audience here, are you ready to find out who will be Miss Teen USA 2014? <laughs> Alrighty. The winner of Miss Teen USA 2014 is South Carolina. So the first runner up is Mississippi. Congratulations, Miss South Carolina. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Miss Teen USA 2014, South Carolina. Come on, keep the applause going. If you'd like to be on the pageant cast crowning chamber, send the photo of the crowning moment and fill out the form at pageantcast.com. We're back. We're back with Patience Valier. She's Miss Wisconsin Teen USA 2014. So glad to have you back on the show. Now, tell us a little bit about you just came back from Miss Teen USA. You were a top 15, correct? Yes. <laughs> yes, I was. That, that has to be amazing. What was that experience like? Um, it was amazing. It was super intense, and it was super fast-paced, and um, it was it was everything that we as title holders live for. I mean, it's that week that we compete for and um, put year, a year of preparation into it, and it it was amazing. It was worth every every bit of preparation that we put into it. It was worth every every last bit of it. And I was so excited just to be there and to be around those girls and. There's not one girl who wouldn't have done an amazing job as our national title holder. I mean, we had an outstanding group of girls, and those judges had a hard job. <laughs> you had an amazing gown. Why don't you tell us all about it, Patience? Thank you. It was a McDougal, and um, I loved it. I, it was, I had tried on probably 20 dresses before that, and there were some that I really liked, and I would have done all right with, and... It's like, yeah, you know, I like the white one, I like the gold one, I like the green one. That green one is, I can do that. I can see that. I can envision it. But I put that purple one on, and I kind of walked in it and moved around in it, and I was just like, yes, this is it. Just, you just get that feeling. It's like when you find your prom dress, and, like, for the girls that are watching, you know, um, when you get your junior prom dress, and it's everything you wanted, and it, you just get that feeling. I don't know. I had that feeling. Or your wedding dress. Well, I think I'm going to get married. Anyway. I think the goal of a great gown is to be noticed and to be remembered. And there was certainly a lot of talk online about your gown. Right. I I went into it as myself. I wasn't really going into it with the goal of being remembered or winning necessarily. Every girl wants to win. But if you go in with the goal of winning, there somebody's suddenly disappointed, you know, there's, there's 
one winner. There are 50 girls. You know, if you go in with winning being your only intention, I mean, you're going to leave disappointed. So I went in as myself, and that dress was me. It was the embodiment of who I am. It was classic. It had edge to it. It was high fashion, and it reminded me a little bit of, like, that classic Dior, that full um, kind of dark almost that um, just, it had body to it, and I loved it, and, and it was me, and the judges could have taken it or left it. It didn't matter to me. It was me, and I was happy in it, and that's what mattered. Patience, what's your favorite part of competition? My favorite phase, aside from, like, backstage and behind the scenes, meeting all the uh, things, my favorite is... Um, Probably the interview. I mean, it's that face-to-face -face contact that um, you, where you get to showcase who you are and you get to show yourself. And you that's where you get the judges to really remember you and remember you as a person. That's where you showcase, you know, how how would I make a good title holder? Like, what, what do I have that makes me different? And that just makes me excited. <laughs> Now, we're coming up on, on you having to pass that crown along. Tell us a little bit yes. about Miss Wisconsin USA this year. Um, Miss Wisconsin USA and Miss Wisconsin Team USA 2015 will take place on September 6th and 7th um, in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin. Okay. Do, do we and know where in Fond du Lac? Here? Um, at the Performing Arts Center at the high school. Okay. Yep. It's been there for the last four years. It's an awesome venue. It's so, it's a great stage. And the staff is awesome. The production staff for future productions, they do a great job every year. Um, so for incoming contestants or people who are looking at applying, please, 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 please apply. You can do this. It doesn't take a whole lot. I mean, it's an amazing experience. It just takes a little bit of courage to just step out on that stage and you are never going to want to leave. I promise. So, <laughs> and you up and your eyes open about it. And how do they go about applying? I'm, I'm guessing the application is on the website? There is an application on the website. Um, www.misswisconsintnusa.com or misswisconsinusa.com um, Yeah, if you just go onto the website and apply um, for your state, it's an easy application. You just get some personal information, a little bit of why you want to do it and why you think you would make a good title holder. And they get back to you right away with um, your applicant information and how you go through the process. They go through it step by step with you. There's, I mean, um, Libby and Denise are directors for the state of Wisconsin. They um, do an amazing job back to you. They get back to you right away. There's, if you have questions, feel free to ask them. Um, they, they do an amazing job. Fantastic. Well, thank you so much for your time today, Patience, and, and thank, thank you for you. having some patience with me. Oh, no problem. <laughs> That's been done a thousand times, I'm sure. <laughs> so, <laughs> something we like to do at the end of each of our shows is uh, see your best pageant wave so I'd, I'd like to see your best pageant <laughs> wave uh, it, it, now now I know that you have a fantastic one I have that on best authority so let's see your best pageant wave for real or like yes for I real can I get this up? we're not kidding around here this is serious stuff let's see this pageant wave oh my goodness that is ready for the convertible Ready to go <laughs> in the back of the convertible. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Patience. At, at the end of each show, we also say Tierra Dream. So to you and to all your friends at Wisconsin Team USA, Tierra Dreams, Patience. Thank you. Pageant cast.